Welcome to Vrakis Blum Computer Consulting Sage Tips and Tricks. Today's video will demonstrate how to add a new company into your Sage install. We're going to start by going to Library Master, into Main, and into Company Maintenance. First, we're going to click on the lookup to take a peek at the other companies we have and ensure we're not making a duplicate company code. After we've confirmed that we're not going to duplicate anything in here, you can go ahead and hit cancel and type in your new company code. Note, you should stay away from CON or SOA for company codes and also avoid company codes such as 001 or 000 as well. Go ahead and enter all the company information that you have. address, phone number, fax, email address, website. Once you're good that all of this information is correct, go ahead and hit the activate button. This pop-up will come up. You're going to want to say yes. You do want to save this company. And then you're going to get another pop-up that will give you all of the modules you have available. You're going to go ahead and select the ones that you want this company to use. Please note that common information and general ledger must be selected in order for this company to be created correctly. Now that I am sure I have all of the modules I want this company to be able to use, I'm going to go ahead and hit proceed. You'll see a pop-up showing you the modules being activated. Once that's done, you can go ahead and hit accept and you can close out of company maintenance to double check if you want to go back in. Look in here and you can see that Kelly's Cookies is now a company in your Sage install. If there are any issues with this, please contact your trusted consultant. And for more helpful Sage tips and tricks, please check out our other videos at v-bcc.com. Thank you and have a great day.